going on? This is EJ, you know, and today I'm going to be doing a vlogging on redoing my whole Honda 1999 Accord. I know it's an old car, but you know what I'm saying? It's my baby. It's been keeping me down for so long. And I'm about to redo the whole inside, about to clean the engine, about to get all into that, I'm about to vlog about it, about to get right it, all into it. So right here, you know what I'm saying? We're going to change the steering wheel color. We're going to change the mats on the floor. I always double it up with the mat and about to change everything. It's about to be the, the green inside, um, about the um, hand rest holder, neck rest, about to change the wheels, the color of the wheels, about to, like I said, clean the engine, make the tires shine, about to um, feed the gas, and lean to make the, make, feed the gas to preserve on the gas, and I'm about to do it all up. And um, before I get all into that, don't forget to give me a subscribe button. Hit that um, ding. And um, you know what I'm saying? Let's get into it. Let me get this day started. You know, but trust me, I'm not going to be like this for too long. I'm about to get fresh and clean after and get a get a cut. And um, as I get done with this, so you're going to be on a journey with me doing the car while I'm all up into it. All right. So let's get into it. We'll be back. Look at this car, it's all dirty, but that's okay. We about to get this thing all looking nice. All this is gonna be looking great, great. Trust me, we about to get all up into it. Here at the vacuum place for free. About to first store, clean, get this, all the stuff sucked out of here. All this like dirt and everything out of here. Wow. Yo. Yeah, cause I'm about to make this car nice, nice inside. You know what I'm saying? No. 19. Trust me, you're gonna see a 1999 Honda looking really nice when I get done with this today. And you know what I'm saying? Check those pictures out on Instagram. You know what I'm saying? Follow me on the Instagram thing. I'll leave a link below so you can see more pictures of, of the car. So, uh, let me do this. I can have two hands and I'll be back. All right. What's going on? I, hey, I know you guys gonna start. Uh, whew, my allergies acting up. Wiping this car inside and out. You know what I'm saying? I know I'm looking rough right now. I know that people are gonna start saying shit about me, but that's okay. Cause you know what I'm saying? I'm not gonna clean my car. <laughs> looking clean and everything but uh you know comment below you know what i'm saying if you got an old car even if you got a new car and you want to fix it up link below you know what i'm saying if you need some input on how to do it i'll give you my input you know i learned from my stepdad you know what i'm saying um big thanks to bill for helping me out you know what i'm saying taught me a lot about that um <clears throat> but yeah um wiping it wiping it out right now getting all this gook and everything off before I start putting everything on about to see how this stuff all turn out you know what I'm saying wanted to uh, go with a color I never did before see how it all turns out as you see I'm wiping everything out trying to get everything clean and everything going through this stuff <coughs> all up in there but anyway like i said i'm gonna be doing like cuts of videos trying to get all this stuff all cleaned up and everything uh so i'll be back I'm back right now a little walk through through the car as well as you guys know if you guys haven't like if you guys have a car that's eating up gas and everything um i suggest you pick up a gas treatment to preserve on the gas and everything. So right now I picked up some super, super gas treatment and um, about to load it up into my gas tank. Um, so 
you know, as I say, it says super gas treatment works in collapsed fuel tanks, adds powerful cleaning um, to the gas you stay for. Okay, so shake it up, you know what I'm saying? Directions, add a fuel tank up to 20 gallons. Okay, so I'm gonna add this to my gas tank right before I start doing my windows. And, um, you know what I'm saying? Let it work itself through as I'm cleaning my car so I can preserve all my gas. All right. Going on, about to get all up into the engine right now. My engine is very oily, very oily, very dirty. But you know what I'm saying? I'm about to get all up into that, about to check everything, make sure everything's all good on here. Um, got some engine <clears throat> spray. Where's that at? Oh, that's not that, that's not that. No, I had it. Oh, you know what? It's in the house. Anyway, but you know what I'm saying? I'm about to get all up into that, had to check it out. Wanted to do a video. Uh, let you guys know what it looks like before and after when I get done with it. So, um, about to, I think I'm about to get into these wheels right now. All right. Okay, so now we're back. I had to take a little break. Uh, right now, we're about to put the wheel cover on, put the mats in there, <clears throat> and lay this on top of here. About to um, mount the. <coughs> oh, excuse me. About to go mount the cell phone holder in there about to get all into and put the new covers in so uh yeah about to get all up into this and about to do it up so that smells really good in here oh. oh man we're gonna do this It's coming along. Hey, if anybody out there know how to change the color of a Kenwood CD changer, uh, can you let me know? Cause it's red right now, but I'm like I said, I'm doing everything green. So if anybody knows how to the, I, mean, I guess I could YouTube it, but there's so many Kenwood CD changers out there or CD portable players. This one, let me know how to change the color, cause I want to change it to green. So, as you see, I'm almost through with everything. Um, now, I put the the head red cushion thing on, have a little holder in here. Uh, as you see, I put the little sun blocker things in to keep it cool in the car. Now, I'm about to get all up into putting the layers for the seats in. I think this is for one seat. It's for the next seat. So, um... See if I remember how to do all this. All right, so you gotta be real careful when you do it. So. Okay. Put it real easy on so it don't tear the stitching of it. I have did it so many times. And I have torn the stitch on it. Yep, did it again. That's okay. Put the camera on. See, see we'll do a quick video on how it's gonna look. I'll put the pillow at the bottom because that cushion to my butt. I'm driving, I got more cushions. I got more. See, it's all coming together. Yeah, we're just gonna overlap this pillow inside of here. To be. Let's see. Oh, there you go. Okay, I 
Let's see. Let's see. The lime green. On it. this on but for backrest so I'm supposed to put it on like oh I ain't supposed to do it. I'm supposed to go on here so it fits everything. I think it goes like Actually I think oh yeah there you go So for back support There you go so about to do the whole car like this. I'll be back. So you know what I'm saying, I'm back again. Uh, just finished doing the car, as you see, did the insides. About to go wash the engine. Got my little day one right here. And uh, you know what I'm saying, I got the little fresh cut. Cut the hair a little bit. Shit up. And uh, you know what I'm saying, got the new gear on. Got the little uh, TI little shirt on. A little shirt, TI shirt on. About to go wash out these engine. And uh, about to finish up. That's the last thing I'm going to do. Then, uh, you know what I'm saying? But hey, just don't forget to subscribe. Give me thumbs up. Hit that thing at the bottom of it. And um, so you can know when new notifications come in. And um, you know what I'm saying? Keep on subscribing. People you don't know, let them know about me. And you know what to do. And I'm um, about to get into this engine.